Where are you running off to? Work. I'm late again. Unbelievable. Unfucking believable. What time is it? 10.30. What time are we supposed to be there? 8. Seriously, I don't mean to sound corny, but uh, I can't really vocalize the way I feel about last night. I felt like we connected, and it kind of felt right. Please tell me you felt something. Well, we did do a lot of drinking last night. But you're right. I did feel something. But I just want to take things slow, nothing... Yeah, yeah, that's fine with me too. That's fine, it's great. But I really gotta go right now. Or I'm gonna lose my job. Oh. Okay? Uh, okay. Oh, wait. Um, how do you propose I get home? Oh, I don't know, sweetie. There's a, there's a bus station right down... Did I say bus? I meant to say, you should probably take a cab. Oh, perfect. Thank you. Thank you.
Did you get all my messages? Yeah, sorry, I've been really busy lately. You, you have something on your face. Where? Right, right here. So, when are we gonna get together again? Well, I wanted to give you a heads up. My father has been looking for you. Really? For rent. Oh, shit. I may be able to buy you a week or two. It will take a little more than a phone call, though. Really? Well, maybe we can work something out. You think? Definitely. So, am I going to hear from you in a week or two? No, I'll call you tonight. But right now, I really got to go. Well, I'm going to hold you to it. Okay. Charlie, don't blow me off this time. That, this is my car. I'm late for work. I'm gonna lose my job. Please don't tell my car. Can, I, can you help me out here? I need I need my car right now. Uh, I need to go to work. I'm gonna be late for work. Every fucking day. Please, please, Let's, just help me out. All right, check it out. Gonna, I just lifted it. I'll give it to you for $20. Give me $20 and we're good to go. Oh, 20 bucks. Dude, this girl just took my last $20. Could, no, no. How, about, how about a watch? How about a nice couple go fuck yourself? Charlie, it's Cindy. I, you gotta. I, I don't know what's going on right now, but you gotta call me. It's important. Well, isn't this my lucky day, Bobby? Charlie, are you trying to piss me off? No. Listen. What what happened was. Do you have my money? I just need a couple more days. Do you have my money? No, but I can get it. I just need a couple of days. Throw his ass in. I'm gonna show this motherfucker how serious I am. Meet me at the park in five. with my 50 grand. Stupid. I'm telling you, it was a sure thing, Bobby. I had a sure thing. A sure thing? Davis knocked him out in the first round. No, uh, man, I seen these two suits talking about it in the bar the other night, saying Davis is going down. Davis is taking a dive. First of all, you never bet on a white guy in boxing. And second, everybody knew Davis was gonna win. It was just a question of what round. No, hey, man. Who's talking here? I am. Listen, these guys were talking real quiet, like they didn't want anybody to hear, but I heard them. It was like, D D Davis is taking a dive right before the bell. Davis is taking a dive. The bell? <laughs> Did these guys mention anything about the stock market? Maybe. What's so funny about that? Dumbass. They were talking about Davis Pharmaceuticals. I dumped that stock last week. You put the stock market? 
I got a 401k. <laughs> what the fuck are you laughing about? Get off. Charlie, you're truly an idiot. But do not mistake my kindness for weakness. Our friendship bought you one day. Today is that day, Charlie. So by midnight, you better have my money. Oh, fuck. Come on, Bobby. Oh, God. You know who this is? No. This is the last motherfucker who didn't have my money when I took my fucking money. I think I'm gonna be sick. Oh, you're gonna be sick already. <laughs> you, you better have my money, Charlie. Because if you don't, this trunk is for you. And you see this motherfucker right here? If you don't come up with 50 grand by midnight, this is the last motherfucker you're ever it. gonna see. I can get it. I swear to God, I can get your money. If you don't have the money, you're not even gonna see me coming. I'm the one praying you don't get the fucking money. Damn, man, yo, what happened to you, man? Oh, I'm all right, man. It's the same as the new thing. Sure, she got like, robbed out here, man? No, this is they awful, didn't rob man. me. It's rough out here, they man. They didn't rob me. I mean, give me a fucking wallet, man. What? Hurry up, man. What? Hurry up, man. Give me a fucking wallet, Fucking man. again? Are you oh, kidding man. me? Hey, 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 hey. Hey, that's a wallet. Let me see this fucking wallet. Yo, get a fucking wallet. You, you know give what? Give me the fucking wallet. You want my fucking watch, too? Give me the fucking watch. It's a good Father's Day gift, man. Hurry up. Hurry up. The fuck is this, man? This is a joke? A dollar? You disrespecting me? Oh, that's all I got. This fucking hat, bitch man. took hey, my last 20 bucks this morning. Ain't got nothing else, I ain't got shit, I, man. What's I show you, man? What the fuck? All right, man. All right, man. Fuck it. Fucking dollar, man. Get the fucking hat, man. Disrespect, man. The fuck? You know what this is, man? Get the fuck up, man. Get the fuck up. Fucking dollar, man. Well, see, I'm in big trouble today. You are always in big trouble. They're gonna fucking kill me if I don't give them this money. I don't care. When they hit me on the way to work, they're gonna fucking kill me today if I don't give them this money. You don't believe me? You know what? You know what? You're right. I don't believe you. But more importantly is that I don't care. Because as far as I'm concerned, you don't even work here anymore. What? That's right. Why don't you go clean out your locker and get your knives and get the fuck out of my kitchen right now? And fuck you, man.
Feva, if I ever needed you, I need you now. Listen, man, I'm in some serious shit. I need a boatload of money by midnight. Listen, I can explain the whole thing over drinks next week. I just need the money. If you can get me out of this, I'm willing to do just about anything. Y yeah, fine, anything. Oh, I know there's a difference. Just fucking tell me what it is. My kidney? Oh, don't I need that to live? I have to? Wait, 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 wait. You're trying to tell me that you know somebody's gonna give me $50,000 for one of my kidneys. I have two, and I only need one to live. What? This afternoon? Oh, God. All right, thanks, Hobbs. I, I gotta call you back. Shot in a beer. Oh, Jesse, Jesse. Boy, am I glad to see you. Charlie, I was actually on my way out. Please, please, just talk to me for a second. Right. Listen, right. since I left the house this morning, I got puked on. Uh, I was harassed. My car was towed. I got, I got smacked around. They threatened my life. Uh, I got, I lost my job. Somebody stole my watch. They pissed on my wallet. Please, just, just have a drink with me. No, no attachments, no expectations. Uh, so you haven't been home yet? No. All right, Charlie, one drink, then I really have to go. Thanks. Bartender. Did you say someone urinated on your wallet? Yeah, but that's the least of my problems. The biggest problem is that I owe somebody really mean a whole lot of money. And what's a whole lot of money? Like a whole lot of money. Like ten thousand dollars? Like fifty. And I need it today. And you want to know the worst part? There's more. I have a way out of all of this. You mean to tell me that you have a way to come up with fifty thousand dollars today? Yeah. It just requires a really huge sacrifice on my part. Sacrifice. What are you getting yourself into here, Charlie? Well, it turns out that I have something that somebody else wants, and they're willing to give me 50 grand for it. What do you have that's worth $50,000? My kidney? You're kidding. No. Did you know you had two? Yeah. Well, I didn't. Okay, so you're contemplating this major surgery. Yeah. At what hospital? Oh, no hospital. It's somebody's house. Uh, I don't know. My buddy's setting the whole thing up. You mean you're having an organ removed at somebody's house? Don't you think that's a little sketchy? I know. It sounds a little extreme, but the people I'm dealing with aren't kidding around. And I really don't have any other option. Charlie. The thought of you having this surgery, it's really scaring me. And as I was cleaning out your place this morning, I kept thinking about what you said. <laughs> and you're right. We do have something special. So I want you to know that I'm here for you. And if you're going to do this, we're going to do it together. Wow. I just met you 24 hours ago, and all of a sudden it seems like you're the only person on earth who cares about me. Why don't you give your buddy a call, and I'm going to go to the ladies' room. Cindy, what's going on? Are you moving out without telling me? 
No. What are you talking about? Well, I saw some girl walk past your apartment carrying a, a suitcase, and she even had your painting. What's going on? Are you are you serious? Do I sound like I'm fucking hitting you, Charlie? This girl is about 5'3", brown hair, green eyes. She kind of looks like me. I almost called the cops. Did you want me to? Okay. 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 Yeah. About that thing we were just talking about. Yeah, how's that healthy 25-year-old female sound for the part? Right. I'll see you in a half an hour. So Rebel Entertainment, bitches. For all the world's records. The Master Dawns. Yes. Yeah. 